Hello everyone, this is Chris Burns from Slash Gear. Today we're taking a look at the Samsung Galaxy Note 10.1. Uh, this version is coming from Verizon. It's the first version to come with 4G LTE. It's now on a couple of the carriers, this being uh, one that just came out yesterday. And uh, we're taking a look. Now what we got here is the newest edition of the uh, software as well as the hardware. When we saw this device first, it was using, using sort of a older version of what we're seeing now. Now it has sort of a premium uh, look and feel it has different features that are only available in uh, like Jelly Bean. Like if you pull up on your home screen there, your home button, you get uh, Google Now. That'll pop up like like so. Um, if you go back out here and you tap down here, uh, you get a selection of apps. These are open, able to be opened anywhere you uh, need them open. Like if I go, if I get back out here, I tap out and I go to my apps and I want to open, let's say we just open our downloads. So there's nothing there, but if we pop this open, we go to internet, we can see that we can get this half screen. We can go with dual view or we can go with cascade view. If I do cascade view, this little window is able to be moved around and I can uh, make it larger or I can pop out of it completely like that. Um, if we want to do cascade view, that's good for if you want, uh, for example, if I want to go to YouTube and uh, I'm going to watch, do this, not now. Uh, we can go to a video. Let's go ahead and go to the Timberwolves Harlem Shake. At the same time as that's playing, I can go to uh, S Note. Like if I want to go to S Note, I tap that. We're going to go ahead and uh, make it into a dual view. If I can make it work here. Dual view. Now I have that on one side and this on the other side. Sometimes it's a little bit buggy as you can see as when it taps out it kind of loses itself we'll go ahead and do with cascade view for now put that right there now what i can do while i'm watching that i can pull out my s pen here and i can start a note if i do that i'll be able to write a note like so as you can see this is a pressure sensitive so i can make it real fat or really skinny there and there you go We'll draw a nice little timber wolf here. He's real happy. He didn't like that video. We can also do things like this. If I hold down the button, take a shot there, and I can do stuff like that with this. I can move it to Kindle. I can uh, send it through email, group cast, all that good stuff. Now, uh, again, the major difference between this version of the device and the one that came up before is the fact that it's on 4G LTE is with uh, Verizon, meaning there are several apps that come with this that don't come with the other one. You can get mobile hotspot right there, my Verizon, uh, connections to several Verizon things. You also have smart remote. That was with the original version as well. Uh, this connecting to your IR blaster right there. So you can connect to your TV. It doesn't need to be a smart TV. It can be any TV. You can see on the back here, we also have a giant uh, Verizon 4G LTE uh, logo. Samsung, just the sticker just tells you what it's about. Up on top, you have your uh, camera. You also have a LED flash there, micro SD right there, uh, volume, power, right here, headphones, and there's your place for your micro SIM. On the left side you have nothing, and the right side you have nothing, and up on front is where your speakers are. One of the great things about this device is that the speakers are forward facing, so they're actually blasting towards you instead of uh, towards the back, which is where a lot of devices uh, still to this day continue to blast their sound even though it makes more sense to go forward. So check it out, it's in stores right now.